attack these Jesus things that are going to deal with me. Oh sweet! Got one. Yeah, they're they're not really nice enemies. Um, they're just a hindrance, but well. This area becomes annoying later on. Around here, there are some beastly platforms. If I had gone myself, well, not myself, my hands, okay, that's just an instant smash. Not really important. But not really important yet. Uh, let's move for sake, let's move see. Alright, this is going so totally gnarly. Okay. Let's see what the cages have for us in store. And I believe that's the boost ball! Ooh, that's... No! It's not the boost ball! It's the spider ball! Okay, now that's what I'm talking about. Now that's a good question. Now this is some top quality stuff. Like the spider ball by itself doesn't seem to do lot much, but it actually lets me access a small thing with running trees fairly early, and uh, also lets me to stop to not bother with the bottle. That's kinda amazing for such a small item. Okay. Uh, have I climb back up? That's uh, fine. Oh. Uh, no. I'm going to be attempting the tunnel just yet. Oh, come on. That's not fair. That's really not fair. Do have boxes here? No, I don't have boxes here. Too bad. Okay, I jump, I jump, I jump. Can I make it in time? Yes, I need it in time. Why take this long static room instead of going directly <coughs> the other way? Well, because these have kind of more goodies to try to get. Ah, uh, more goodies is good for silence. Okay, those are the torrents. So I wasted a lot of time for nothing. Ooh. I'm not sure if that's a glitch or just a normal thing. Oh. Okay, see that place? Yes, they are all the way up there. And this little freaking thing is kinda annoying. Oh, this drops the world? Yes, this drops the world. Right. Left. Right. Right. Oh, come on. Sam. There we go. That's. Okay. 
That's sick. That's sick. Yay! SGB! 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 Okay. This is supposedly a glitch called damage. So I'm not sure if it's correct or if I'm actually pulling it. I don't know. I need more in tanks before I attempt that. Because that one is the stuff of the snipers for me. And with just 89 health points, I'm not confident I can make it. Actually, let's go all the way back. Actually, no, let's go back. Let's retrace this route. I am. I must be a bit distracted, but oh well. Here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna go ahead, pick this orb up, trace my steps, trace my steps, I'm like 90% sure it's the thermal bison. If it is, it's not a go it's not a huge deal. It, it only allows me easier, easier, mind you. Holy crap, that was a hell of a job. Yeah. It only allows me for an easier and I just press for easier starters, not much else. Well, I can also grab the expansion that's here. Oh, why not? It needs some, it needs a bit of timing, some patience, and it needs some skill. Oh, sorry, I okay. Or none of the above. I'm not kidding, I this usually takes me a way, way many way too many tries. One of the reasons why I avoid that tunnel in spite of my can go ahead and hug me. It's because the chances I get a game over are very high. Because I suck at Trivi Jane. Is this chamber? No. No no it is It's this or the other one. Let's see it's the other one. Mind you only make some things Actually, it reminds me, I wonder what made the retrospectors change their minds on how to touch the invisible robot makes your minds. And the problem with the face of minds, it's not much really. Not a terrible area to be in. The Omega Pirate, it's perhaps the worst of it, but that's kind of saying what it's best. The Funky Hounds give me a nice challenge. I'm gonna go for another half an hour. Another half an hour, and I stop. Well, it's less half an hour and more 40 something minutes, but. Up. Up. Down. I jump up. I jump up. When the elevator goes down. Like so. And there is. Okay. Going up. 
this technically allows for reverse flagra, but reverse flagra has a problem. If I do reverse flagra, flagra on spawns. I have no idea if the developers fixed that issue. So, not going to touch that one. The 50 foot pole. Because I like being able to complete the game, you know? It's kinda nice being able to complete a game. Actually, now that I have the SPG, the, the space jump boot, so SPG, not SPG. Sorry. Now that I have them. Right, right. Now that I have them, I can pull this trick. Now that I have both pull, I can go right here. Oh, really? No missing. Got some losers. I don't even I have a little bit for now, or fiddle, so... Yeah, another expansion. There's a glitch a little that allows me to climb that thing, or, or something like that, but... I tried it a few times in the past and I never managed to pull it off. I got off after like 200 tries. So let's move from here. Uh, right, I have to go there. Actually, t actually having the spider ball benefits me in an unexpected way now that I remember. It allows me to clear one extra treasure slash expansion from a certain place inside. Oh come on, I hit that mess. There might be some slight audio synchronization issues because, well, my my pro my capture program, that is Vegas Video Capture, is is refusing to pick my microphone audio, so I have no idea why. Sorry for spacing out for a second, I was kind of expecting the chosen ones. And that's why the X-ray visor is a little bit more useful than the thermal visor. The X-ray one will let me absolutely see the ghost and take a lot of pain out of them, make them from an annoying an annoying task to something very easily accomplished because for two stuff have never played Prime 1 in their lives the Chosen Ghosts have a shall we say peculiar ability and by peculiar I mean god this is annoying you can L target them all the time they have these ways of breaking out from you. Oh, it's also early. Actually, this is the They have this way, the Chosen Ghosts have this way of vanishing suddenly, and well, that's kinda annoying, and they disappear. Oh no, no, it wasn't 